What's up guys? Welcome back. You're back to another video. And in today's video, we have an F31 chilling like a villain. You guys saw in the last video that we picked up the Dream Spec F31, and I want to make this thing the Dream Spec F81 M3. And hopefully in a much faster pace than the E91 M3. The E91 M3 has taken me about two years and it's still not done. This bad boy is the exact spec I would want it to be when it's done, but from an F31 to an F81. So without further ado, let's just go ahead and get started with this build. Just wanna pack up my things and go. Just wanna be free, just wanna zone. Just wanna flow, just wanna hang with the gang, but sometime chill on my own. Just wanna do me, just wanna doze. Just wanna live and see how it goes. And the goals just keep on going, yeah. This life we live is a Thankfully, I just remember before I should take it off this front bumper. Let's go ahead and take it to the back and get some photos for you guys so we can actually get these parts listed up. You know when the call is calling you and the call is calling more. You know when the call is calling you and the call is calling So guys, just took off the bumper. This bumper was so complicated. This car has the windshield washer system. It has the cameras. It has the PDCs. It has literally everything. Plus it's an M Sport, so it got all the grills. Oh yeah, it also has fog lights. So this thing had a billion connectors back there. Thankfully, everything's in good shape. Um, also throwing in the seal for the customer as well. So he's getting all of that. And he's also getting the rear bumper and the side skirts. I actually have to head out right now. I'm gonna take you guys on a little journey with me. I gotta go junk a car. So I guess you guys are gonna be seeing that happen. And then we'll get back to parting out the F31. Don't go shooting all the dogs cause one of them got fleas. Don't just listen to these songs and think that you got grease. They just lyrics, I'll be venting to this mic, it's therapy. You could leave, but the mother guys is whack, they not me. God speed, sweetie, living out my dreams. I don't need a genie. Pops did Madonna shows, music in my blood, it was destined for me. Way before I even can seen a CD, cross the wrong line, you gon' need a treaty. Peace is a lie, there is only passion. And through passion, I get stronger. Long days working on getting better, but they only get longer. Getting there is half the battle, staying there is much harder. I've been flying out the island so remote, we must charter. Been a pro for 10 years, trying to go another 10. These guys took literally forever. Oh my god, it's finally our turn, guys. I'm not messing with y'all. I've been here for about 35 minutes. These guys just took their sweet time. That's a joke. You just be like in and out two, three minutes. It's my turn now. Let's just get this car junk so we can head back to the shop and keep doing what we're doing. Even for my little ones, my real ones, for people trying to feel some For all the bridges burned along the way and how we still run and still swim Even though we underwater, never hit the kill switch And overcome like everything we deal with, I still Feel there's more for me to do until I call it quits Everything I do is for the ones I love and miss Takes just like that guys we got the rear bumper off of the f31 wagon and it's looking pretty crazy because this is honestly the next step to what we have to take to start converting this into an f81 m3 wagon i don't know if you guys remember with the rear quarter panels basically we have to get the m3 wheel arches and then also the m3 brackets and then also the m3 rear bumper we actually have a donor car coming in right now to actually start this rear end conversion so it's probably gonna be the first thing we'll be doing on this car that was obviously not the case for the e91 m3 but we are approaching this thing absolutely differently with a different budget as well so this thing's gonna be built a whole lot quicker and a whole lot sicker yeah let's see how you do under pressure oh yeah i've been wanted this forever i've been in the field with whatever they throw at me brush it off pick myself up moving on to the better okay hey yeah ain't no errors baby it's a new era i wake up early feeling rich like i'm cash i get to the paper boy extra extra Work with me, you know that I got it Come with me, let's take a trip to the islands We up on the jet, we'll do more than just fly on it Stand on that hill, you gon' die on it Boom. Boom. Baby, I'm not one of them, you should try on it Miss me with all that I'm on it in Dex yeah. Rip this up, I'll send you back to your ex But good luck with that, this is big as it gets Hey, okay. let's see how you do under pressure yeah. Let's see how you do under pressure Give them a name to remember Hey, okay, okay. let's see how you do under pressure yeah. Let's see how you do under pressure a moment can live on forever. 
Just like that, guys, the car is pretty much looking like a bare shell. But obviously, it's far from it. We still have the drive chain in it. The car is still running and driving. We have all the fenders off, the panels off, we have the side skirts off, the hood, the fenders, the bumper, uh, the rear bumper as well. The way it sits right now is what we're reusing. So we're reusing the trunk, we're reusing the quarters, we're reusing the doors, obviously the roof. Everything else that we're not reusing is already off the car. So the exterior of the car is pretty much done. I guess, actually, we do have the mirrors. Um, so we probably gonna remove those as well just so we can actually list that up sell it use those funds to help us with the m3 donors some good news is actually we actually got two donor cars on the way one of them for the interior the other one for the drivetrain so we have two donor cars coming in hopefully we'll be showing you guys that here in a future video it's gonna be pretty sick because one of them is very 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 rare and the other one has a super clean interior that's gonna be going inside of this and making this wagon the ultimate wagon so again stay tuned for that but in the meantime guys i think actually to complete for today's video of getting the external of the car fully stripped down i want to knock off these mirrors so i think we do have to move the door panels for that so let's go ahead and do that real quick out of all the years that i've removed trims i've never seen trim come off like that <laughs> the dash one was slightly peeling and now this one just came completely off um, it looks like factory glue. I just don't know if this car was a different, it probably must be an out of state car. Humidity, humidity does this to cars, but I'm a California car guy and the only cars you get here, I've never ever seen this before. So this is just, it's just not, not used to it. Good news, we got all these parts off the car as well from the interior. So these are parts, again, we're gonna be selling uh, here at Natty Auto Parts with the hood, the two fenders, uh, things we also took off on this car. It's looking more and more ready for this F80 conversion. As of right now, this all the stuff you guys see right now that's in white is gonna stay with the F80 build. Everything else, as you see, including those wheels, are gonna be gone and fully converted. Actually, this quarter panel is gonna be cut and converted as well. Uh, but there's no more panels are moving off this car. That's actually why I wanted a really good donor car, um, just because we can keep all the shadow line, we can keep the roof, we can keep those uh, beautiful uh, black sport roof trims, uh, we can keep the original hatch, we don't have to paint inside, outside, the hatch we don't have to paint the frame of the car which is white as well which is super nice it obviously needs a lot of cleaning but and not to mention this thing is decked out in options including the 360 cam as you can see the wiring for that is already there and right here as well so basically what i'm trying to say guys getting a good donor car is literally it's, it's kind of like prep work getting a good prepped car or prepping a car just makes it so much easier to actually complete the build in a way more timely manner has comfort access has every other option i ever want including heads-up display the windshield itself is made for heads-up display display as well so that doesn't need to get replaced it's a perfect donor car that e91 m3 i realized by getting a base 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 spec wagon made it very difficult to complete that build it looks absolutely stunning even though it's filthy but man oh man that car was one heck of a build but yeah guys if you guys are excited to see this thing get built make sure to smash the like button finally get back to some bmw content and the two donor cars that are coming in for this car and won't be the only two donor cars we're looking for a third donor car for this car for the front end the first two are not going to be using the front ends from um but the first one, uh, the first one we're using the drivetrain from, and the second one we're using the interior from because it's absolutely phenomenal. That being said, guys, it's gonna have to conclude this video. I'll see you guys in the next one. The next one will be a Porsche video. We have a few mods for the Porsche, and it's really coming together. I think as of right now, aesthetically, it is complete. So I'm very, very happy with how the car came out. And it's gonna be here October 26th for you guys to see in person uh, with the brand new wing, the brand new exhaust. Might as well say what it is. All the nice mods on there. It's gonna sound so, so, so good. But before we actually conclude this video, don't forget guys to attend our first ever open what is it called like an open open house car 
open house car meet. Our open house, finally inviting all of you guys. For, actually, it's my first ever car meet plus the first ever business car meet. So I'm gonna go on an open house car meet to welcome all you guys to check out the builds in person, also the shop. Um, we're gonna have coffee, we're gonna have donuts and be able to honestly interact with some of you guys. We're gonna be here for a few hours to just talk, check out you guys' builds and at the same time for you guys to check out our future build with the donor car right next to one in person with some of the other projects here on site for you guys to see. So it's gonna be pretty exciting and I cannot wait to see you guys there. Remember October 26th, I'll see you guys here at the shop.